in recent times, um, nutrition has attracted the international spotlight in an unprecedented way, while global hunger and malnutrition uh, continues to underscore the need for urgent action. Three options are available for combating micronutrient malnutrition. These include dietary diversity with fruits and vegetables, biofortification, and supplementation with tablets. Traditional African vegetables have known to contain high micronutrients and contribute significantly to dietary diversity and combustion of micronutrient malnutrition in several developing and developed countries. With the resurgence of traditional African vegetables, there's a need for researchers to understand the interactions between value chain actors, particularly producers, consumers, and the mode of uh, fire farmer buyer linkages. Based on a primary survey conducted in selected local of Malawi and Mozambique, we use participatory evaluation and market research to try to assess the preferences of farmers and consumers for traditional African vegetables, define value chain processes, identify market outlets, as well as mode of farmer buyer linkages. Results show that although 30 to 35% of income is contributed by traditional African vegetables, the linkages between the value chain actors are very weak. Several opportunities and investment options for agribusiness have been proffered in this paper and for more details I recommend that you go and read this paper. Thank you very much for your interest.